Oh. Uh. That sounds like. Oh, death. Hello, World Wide Web. I'm Dr. Shadow, the universe now a little bit soon. Welcome. You're a bit quiet. A bit quiet. That should not be. But uh, yeah, I was trying to figure out exactly how I was going to go about doing the stream today. What exactly I was going to do. One idea I had was to turn on my uh, eye tracker and do the thing you're not supposed to do with eye trackers. You know, everyone always does the same thing when it comes to eye trackers. It's like, I'm going to look at sexy women. But I'm not actually going to look at them, and it's going to be so embarrassing if I do, and you can see where my eyes go. <laughs> no. I'm doing the thing that's like, hey, you know what would be really handy for an eye tracker? Mm. Allowing disabled people to be able to play games that require quick aiming. But people always say, oh, don't do that. It's not the most precise. It's not as good as a mouse or as a joystick. It's like, yeah, if you're able-bodied, but if you don't have work in hands, maybe using your eyes could be a little bit better. Now, problem is, like, I, d I don't have it set up exactly to be perfect, but I do have it set up to work. Uh, wait, let me, let me, uh... Nah. And you see, with the eye tracker going, you can see how far my eyes can go. Okay, lean back. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're gonna look at each dot until it explodes. Okay, I can do that. Boom, I'm good at that. All right, a top roll. Bottom left. Bottom right. All right. Bottom, top right, top left. Boom, it's amazing. A magical eyes, magical eyes. Okay, so we calibrated, we got that going. Now, uh, I have mill mouse. This is what I usually use to get the uh, tracking to work in most games because it just turns your eye tracker into the mouse pointer. And there you go. Works pretty well. Like, uh, right now I'm looking directly at the little eyeball thing, so it's, it's not quite on center. I have to look to the top left of it, uh, top, top left corner of it, uh, a little further off of it, a little higher. Like, you, you gotta look off of it while being able to tell where the pointer is to kind of work with that. But it's normal gamer kind of stuff. Uh, right. You know, this tech is awesome to help people a lot. Yeah, but uh, what, I'm, what I was wanting is to use the eye tracker to aim in video games. And I got it a lot working, but there are issues with it. So let us show you exactly what I mean by that with... Oh no. I don't have EDF5 installed here right now? Damn it. So it's, 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 it's gonna take a little bit of time, I'm afraid, but... Uh, but yeah. Uh, also, that's one thing is if you move the mouse, mill mouse loses, it, it, it turns off the eye tracking for a bit and it takes like a, a good amount of time before it comes back. So I, it's not something that you can use like as well as a mouse at the same time to like, I mean, I can use the mouse at the same time just so I start clicking things precisely that I need. Uh, but I mean, no, I blink to select. You can set that. You can set, like, there are things where you can set it to, like, blink one eye or the other eye for right click or left click and such. There are a lot of different ways you can actually set it up, which would be very handy for people with disabilities, in my opinion. Uh, for me, I'm just trying to get it to work to aim in video games. And the way I got it to work in EDF5, I think, was pretty well. And also, there's a thing I'm trying to do in EDF5 because, uh, uh, Thick Black Daddy would like to play EDF5 with me, but I am way behind on that. But I already got the Platinum Trophy on PS4 with EDF5, so I'm not giving a damn about playing honestly at this point. So I'm, I already went through the first DLC until I got the uh, unlocked Hardest and Inferno difficulty that way. And now I'm going through the second DLC until I get to the point where I can get the highest level gear. <laughs> and then I'm just going to farm that for a while. Okay, so EDF5 is also one of those things where you have to choose if you're using a mouse or if you're using a joystick. So I got to click to say I'm using keyboard and mouse. I'm going into Underground 3. We're going through easy until I get to the level that drops all the best stuff, and then I'm going to work my way up to Inferno until I can get the best stuff and then be like, good. But I can't touch the mouse while doing this. So since attack is left click, I need to go into the controls. <laughs> 
change ranger controls, attack shall be right control. There we go. Okay. That's good. That's good. Okay, so now I am playing just with, like, let's see. Just with the keyboard, so you can see that's how I shoot now. Okay, so let's see. Just playing with my eyes and the keyboard. Not bad. Not bad. Ah, crap. I was looking at my radar. It wasn't working out so well. Does he have any loot? Yeah, oh. Okay. Now you can see about it jittering a bit with the turns. It's also a little... I don't know, it, it, since you're using your eyes so intensely, I don't know, it feels like I'm exercising my eye muscles and they're starting to tense up a bit and I feel like I need to get used to this or not do it for too long. <laughs> maybe maybe I just need to relax. Maybe it's just I'm tense because I'm in the middle of a big damn fight with all kinds of nasty nasties. Okay, no problem. All right, all right, easy peasy. Oh, oh God, ah, all right. Uh, look at chat, <laughs> that's what I'm trying to do. <laughs> Uh, so see, see you in pain. We'll be back. Decker uploaded the video an hour. Yeah, yeah, the Leprechaun 3. How did you stop moving? How did I stop moving? Like, only bad when you stop blinking? Like, uh, what do you mean, how did I stop moving? Because, uh, like, I'm looking at the top of the screen, looking at the bottom of the screen, looking at the middle of the screen, like... It helps at the uh, crosshairs that, right there. But I'm looking directly at the crosshair and I'm drifting a little to the bottom and right. So if I look to the top right, top left of the crosshair, I stop moving. That's that's where my uh, angle is. I gotta look at the top left of things, uh, a little bit to the top left of things to be on center for them. Every time I check the radar, it's like, oh, oh no, no. Okay, here we go, here we go. Oh god, okay, there's there's where they're coming from, okay. Ah, oh, jeez. Ah, you bastard. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. No, where, where am I going? Where am I going? Okay. Can't see. Okay. Normal problem in EDF. 
But normally, when you can't see, you can just rely on the radar and be able to... Ah, bastard, I missed. Ah, you jerk. There we go. Normally, you can just rely on the radar to then be able to... see where everyone is and shoot in the general direction of enemies. And uh, can't really do that like this, because I'm looking at the radar and this is what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, actually it kind of worked. Okay, cool. Ah, dang it. I feel like turning is a little harder. Maybe it's because of the 15 frames on the mouse. Okay. Wait, 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 no, wait, wait, no. Bye-bye. Okay. Now, where do I go now? Huh. Not moving with eyes, just aiming. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just aiming with my eyes. WASD to move around. Huh. Whew. God damn, whew. Uh, let's see, return to game, there we go. Now everything was over here and trying to murder me. Trying to look at my ammo counts and oh, oh, no, wrong, no, wrong, what, control. Yes. <laughs> Press the directional pad instead, oops. Just stare at my guy's ass as intensely as possible. Yep, sounds real good. Wait a dang minute. Everything is above us. Am I going the wrong way? I think I'm going the wrong way. God dang it. Ah, cave missions. Always a pain in the butt. As you can see. Uh, just needed to rest my eyes a bit. All right, all right, all right, all right. No, there we go. Up, oh, no, 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 go over that. Over. Oh. Mm -hmm. All right, we're going. We're making progress now. Going the right way. Gotta go up that ramp, probably. Probably. All right, all right, there we, we go, there we go. Whoop, whoop, mm, mm. Okay, here it is, here it is. Oh, that, no, 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 no. Keep going, keep going correctly. There we go, beautiful. Oh, right. trying to look at the chat. <laughs> See, no, it's no, no uh, new messages. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, okay, that's the right way, that's the right way. Emma, oh, you son of a, all right. Okay. That way, I suppose. Yeah, we'll, we'll get this. We'll get all the little alien bastards. That's a good plan. I see you. Which is important. I have to see you in order to be able to do anything. Oh, jerk. Uh, 
Okay. Got him. Whew. Okay. Dead, dead. Don't worry. Oh, crap. Worry. Oh, silver spiders. Okay. Huh. Huh. <sighs> okay. Oh, I got this. How's it going? Uh, oh, it's going pretty well, young Kazi. I just can't see the chat so well because, uh, well, my eyes are very busy at the moment. This might not have been the best plan for a stream, but that's normal for me. Whew. But yeah, like I say, that it would be a lot easier if every time I checked my health, my radar, or my uh, ammo, it did not then cause my view to just spin all around. If everything around the center was what everything was calibrated for, like look this far to turn, that far to turn, look that high up, that far down, and that's kind of how it worked. I think this would be a lot more usable in terms of like, I am disabled and I need, I want to play a shooting game, but I don't have dexterity in my hands or hands or whatever the case may be. So, yeah. I mean, it's still, like, it's... I, I don't do this very often, so... That could explain why I'm having a little bit of trouble here and there with it. And I'm also trying to figure out where the hell I'm supposed to be going here. That doesn't help. What am I doing? Am I a soldier? Dude. Oh, dang it. I feel like I'm going the wrong way again. But I tried to go the right way, and it, there was no way to go. I need to play this game more often. <laughs> I've, I've lost my edge. Okay. At least running is a lot easier on PC, because all you got to do is hold the shift key instead of hold in the left click. On a DualShock 4, that's an absolute pain in the ass. Oh! Uh... That sounds like... Oh, death. Crap, crap, crap. These guys are still dangerous, even in easy mode. <laughs> I, I was trying to find ways to set a cutoff edge to the eye tracking, but unfortunately, most of them are just designed around... What the? Designed around uh, a single monitor, like, but, you know, with mill mouse, because it translates it to the mouse command... It translates it to mouse commands, I, I actually have slightly longer boundaries. 
Like it, when I look over to the uh, when I look over to the chat, it'll act uh, the mouse pointer will actually go over like three inches onto my right monitor. <laughs> uh, hi, hi, the Gothic Knight. Uh, but yeah, the, setting up a. Uh, See, now I'm looking at the U in pause to get the mouse pointer there. So that's. Maybe I'm a little off center now. Eh. Maybe I should recalibrate. Oh, crap. Okay. Whew. Took care of those golden assholes. I think this is the way. yes. Hard to like I said, it's hard to orient myself and see where the enemies are on the map. Cause oh crap, more stuff coming down. Oh boy. Okay. Crap, 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 crap. Dang it. All right. Okay. All right. Oh man, my eyes. I cannot blink. Oh. Okay, okay. Oh. 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 Pink Panther with a dead. Ah, oh, dead. Dang this. Now, uh. playing with an eye tracker. Do I need to turn on the little ghosty eye tracker to make it obvious? Oh. 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 Ah. Okay. All right. Oh no! Oh, curious. Oh, you jerk. Okay. Loot! Okay, 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 here we go, here we go. <sighs> nice. Excuse me, sir. Thank you. Ah, crap, I gotta go around that way. 
That's the tough part about being a ranger. You got like no uh, mobility. I don't know. You can run really fast in EDF five at least if you have the right equipment. Or you can summon a motorcycle, which is nice, but yeah, they blow up a little easily. And as strange as it sounds, a motorcycle isn't going to get you away from danger. <laughs> your legs, though. You can count on your legs. Okay, so I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight guys heading that way. Towards the thing, okay. Towards the big dead spider. Eight guys, something, something, I don't know. I'm trying to remember how this level's all laid out. Everything looks the same to me. Uh, I think I'm remembering this level more. There's... Oh, there's a lot of them. Okay, that's all of them from there. Crap. Crap, can't see. Okay. Okay. So I'll get the eye drops. Oh yes, please, please, eye drops need. Oh, I'm just here drinking the flaming hot Mountain Dew. That's probably doing the opposite. Really, really could have picked something better. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm, 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 I, I, I think like it should be possible to mod some Starship Trooper stuff into this. Okay, time for death. If I remember right, this might be golden antler. Maybe. Like, eventually, like, will become. Like, isn't now, but soon will be. Yeah, all those things spawning right there might be some golden bastards. I don't like the sounds of them. Just putting that out right there. Oh, there's golden bastards. Ah, oh, motherfucker monsters. Okay, no problem. Huh. You know, maybe I should have just played the normal game on hard mode. Probably wouldn't be as hard. 
But no, I had to try and cheat. Try to try and get to the levels that you can get the best gear on if you play on Inferno. So that then I could cheese it and just try and get a blazer or some shit. Nah. I see you! Huh. Gotcha! Okay, okay. Alright, so that's all that stuff there. Okay, whew. <laughs> oh. This game is full of bugs, in a good way. Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. And there we go. Of course, I let... Try and see, like, EDF videos on YouTube, and usually it ends up always the same. You get people who have... YouTubers who have no idea about the series who load up, start a game with the friends in there, just absolutely just confused by everything. And they have a very good time, but they're idiots. <laughs> it's like, come on, guys. It, it's not really mindless shooter. It take, it, 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 it's, it, you put a lot of thought into it, actually, in the higher difficulties, but you'll never get there because you're never going to play this again, I can tell, because you didn't take it seriously in the first place, you bastards. Okay, I see one red dot there. There, down there, which mean I think every, silver spiders or something gonna spawn in all up my butt here, if I remember right. Oh boy. Or was that it? That was it. Yay! Whew. <sighs> what? Why EDF five downloading from per dr one drive personal? I don't what what. Did... Why is it even in one drive? Like I don't give a damn about your one drive. Okay. Oh, okay. Yes, the breacher, the dunkle, the cascade, the fork, the um four. The rivers for server. Mad custom ass free bike. Menace self propelled railgun. Railguns are kind of fun tanks, actually. V3 plasma core, not your bad. Type C robot bomb. Acibusa. Acibusa. Okay. Oh, but yeah, uh, that's how to play a video game with the eye tracker. <laughs> it's. It's uh, it's tough. It, but I, I still stand by like it, the, the amount of people who are like, oh, you don't want to do eye tracking in video games because it, you're better off with a mouse or with a joystick. I still personally stand by my adage that if you don't got hands, you probably wouldn't mind playing games with an eye tracker, and they should spend a little more time actually integrating this shit into stuff. Just saying, like, it'd be nice to be able to plug the eye tracker into an adaptive controller and have it translate your eye tracking into the right, right analog stick. It would be handy. It would be nice. For certain individuals, it might actually... It might actually be considered optimal. Like I said, if you if you don't have hands. <laughs> if you do not have the appendages that are expected of you. So, thank you all for watching. I've been Decker Shadow. And remember, keep your eye on the target. Or slightly up and to the left, depending on how the calibration went. <laughs>